if you've seen my video about Xbox addictions, you'll know that I hate trolling. Now, sure, there are many types of trolling. Sure, there's the classic online game trolling, where you're literally just messing around with people on Call of Duty and trapping them in corners. And then you've got Xbox addictions. Yeah, we don't talk about them. But today, I'm going to explore another version of trolling. And I think this is one of the many trolling types that really grinds my gears. This is soundboarding. For those of you who don't know what a soundboard is, it's a device that has recorded audio clips and allows you to play them on command. Now, some soundboard trolling can be funny, and you're just not trolling at all. But then you've got soundboard online game trolling. That's what we're focusing on today. For those of you who don't know what soundboard videos are, they're usually where a person takes a soundboard, records some audio clips, and then just messes around with people online to pretend that they're a person that they're not. Now, in my time, I've seen a lot of these videos, and I don't know why, but they just really annoy me. I think one of the main reasons why I hate them is because of how they were created. Seriously, why would you ever come up to make up something like this? Are you trying to fool somebody? Well, guess what? There's like 40-year-old 40 40 men online. And you're over here pretending that you're Pinkie Pie from My Little Pony. So yeah, put off the clown makeup. You're not fooling anybody. One of the other reasons is how entertaining they are. The soundboards aren't funny that in themselves, considering they're just people recorded. Most of the entertainment you're gonna get is from the people playing online, not you. And if there's anything I learned, and you've probably learned too, is that people can be really, really mean online for no reason. So that's really where the, where the entertainment comes from, not from the soundboarding itself. I mean, sure, the soundboard causes the people to get angry, but that's pretty much the same with any trolling video. And does the creator entertained by this? Does the creator like to do this type of stuff? Why would they do this? To get views? I just don't understand how these videos are somehow entertaining. It's just you watching some guy get angry about a freaking guy who's pretending to be freaking Rainbow Dash. And yes, MLP soundboarding is a thing. MLP soundboarding is a thing. You can look it up. Another thing with soundboarding is how boring they can be. When you think about it, all the videos are just technically the same. Just a guy getting angry about some dude wearing a Halloween costume. That's pretty much what the entertainment in these videos are. And what's even more bad about it is that people know that it's a soundboard. They know how fake it is. They even say stuff like, please, dude, just use your regular voice. And that's what I feel like sometimes. You have all these people to interact with, communicate with. But no, you're just over here pretending to be Donald Trump. Where's the entertainment? Why do people like watching this type of stuff? Why do you want to watch some dude pretending to be a dude that they're not? The people that... The people that are in these videos know how fake it is, and they even get annoyed by it just like me. I'm not saying you should hate on soundboards. I'm just weirded out by how they're created and what the entertainment and comedy of them are. I just don't understand how these things exist. So no, I'm not saying that soundboards suck. I'm saying that I just don't enjoy soundboards.
and the way that they were created is pretty weird. I normally do longer discussion videos like this, but a you got what you want.